Hey YouTube, it's me, Jai Harvest Nez, and you see a couple of stuff here, right, right? I was going to go live and do it, but I said it's going to take a long time, so I'd rather do it this way. I have to put up another video anyway, so I said, let me just make another one at the same time. This time, I seen that I didn't make up. I didn't do this. Um, I seen that on YouTube, and I decided to bring it because I know the beginners don't know about this. So, this is another way of doing colored gels this is going to be colored gels and we are going to be using i'm going to show you the stuff that we will be needing that you need to have in your table while you you know doing colored gels just make sure you don't want to mess up your good brushes or whatever just use a brush that they don't use then you know and just have laying around so these are the stuff we're going to be using i got an arm wheel you know just to test the colors that i'm making this is the first time i'm doing it as well so we're gonna do it together so i have one of these i have two color nail polish i just picked these two out um i has also two type of acrylic um paint here which is this americana and this is crafter acrylics it has to be acrylic nail um paint and also you're going to be needing, which I said, a little, I use this little brush for my gel. This is my play around one. A little spatula, whichever spatula makes you comfortable or, or a credit card or something. One of these wooden sticks so you can mix, you know, at the same time. But I use my, if, if you can, if you can't find a spatula to mix, you could also mix it with a wooden stick or a dotting tool something that's pointing you have to have um alcohol so you can clean up your surface and two um cloth you know what i mean so oh and your gel your type of gel i am using this one today so um let's get started so what i'm first one i'm gonna use is let's do it with the um i have these type americana and this one so i'm gonna do Two color gels with this, and we are going to test that out. Yes. So I, what I do, I like to um take my cloth first, and I'm gonna dent it with alcohol. This is just alcohol. I like to dent it, make sure it's wet because this is what you need for gel. At the same time, I'm gonna clean my hands because, and I'm gonna bring you down so you can see this. Okay. So right now what I did, I dent my um, cloth just to make sure I'm going to clean my paper or whatever surface I'm going to be using. Okay. Just clean this up. This is a tile that I got in my house. So you get any type of tile, whatever you, you, you choose to get to make your mixes. I think a tile is better because you can pick up or whatever the case is. <laughs> so the first thing we're going to do, we're going to take a whatever type of spatula whatever you have in your hand that you're going to scoop up a little bit gel i am going to use this because i'm not going to use too much so i'm just going to take a dab of that gel just enough for a nail so i could test it okay there it goes i'll close my gel make sure you close your gel because you don't want nothing to fall in it or whatever. If you use it in a daily basis. And always have your alcohol next to you. Because it's tight to be sticky. So the first color I am going to use is this one. And everybody that knows. I love anything that's shady with purple. So what I'm going to do. I'm going to put a little bit of this inside. Just like that. And I'm going to mix it. Just like so. Okay. I'm going to grab it. Make sure it's in there. Oh, I'm just testing it just like y'all. So, we're doing this together, guys. That's clumsy to me. So, I don't know yet. So, this is a nice purple. Now, the whole point to see if it's, you know, if I could test it with the paint. So I have, like I said, I have those two colors. I might do both of them just to see how it works. Which I see is kind of nice. See that? It's kind of nice. So let's test this. So I am going to grab my tester. 
and the little brush make sure you have it alcohol so you can make sure you wet it and I'm just gonna pick some up it's kind of like sticky though <laughs> of course because it's jaw and I am gonna place it in this now okay and I'm using the builder gel maybe you could use a uh, uh, how you call it uh, nail polish but I'm just using this build up one for now I'm just putting it on there like nothing just want to see if this works this is the first time using this tool so be with me guys Okay, now let's see. I don't know. I don't think I could use this. Maybe it's too much paint. I don't know. Let's see. Okay, let's just let it sit. You always gotta put it kind of backwards so it can level out. I'm just fixing it. I don't know, because I'm doing this at the same time. So, guys. Let's see if it dries up. I have my lamp here. I'm just plug it in. Just waiting for it to level up. Just bugging, you know. Let me time it. And let me sit that in there. While that's getting done, let's get done with the other color. I mean, it's not kind of bad, but it's kind of thicker. So I think you just, with a nail polish, I think it'll be great. But let's see how it dries up, if anything. And it's kind of gooey with this paint. You see it? It's like gooey, if I'm not mistaken. To me, to me. I don't know. Maybe if anybody gets to do this. Maybe do a video on it, but to me it's kind of gooey. I won't, I don't know. Maybe it's the paint. Maybe I could find some other paint that will be better. I have no idea yet, but this is me testing out at the same time. We're doing this together, like I said, we're just doing this together. And then we'll just clean this surface out. As you can tell, I don't get stuck or nothing. See? So good. So let's do the next color while we wait for that one. This time I'm just gonna put a little bit of it. I'm gonna put a little bit, I mean a lot of it. And let's see how that rolls. Where did I put my little spatula? Just had it. Okay, here we go. Just gonna take a little bit enough for one nail. Once again, I'm gonna put it on this plate. Just a little bit, not too much. Remember, this is a build-up gel, so maybe you could do it with the um, top coat gel. You could try that. Whoever does, just do a video on it. I don't have. I think I don't know if I do. Okay, this nail is done. I guess. Let's take out the. Tacky Laker. I mean the tacky Laker. <laughs> the tacky layer. Layer, guys. Oh, no. No, guys. Don't do that. That's a fail. That is a fail. To me. I don't know. Maybe to somebody else it won't be a fail. Not to this side. You see this? I think it has to be a little bit. Hold on, maybe I'm in the wrong side. No, I'm not. Okay, let's let's give it one more try with this color. Let's see. That was a little bit wild out. Let's put a little bit this time. This is like a hot pink. Okay. This is the name of it. This time I'm gonna use this little wooden stick. Just gonna mix that in together. 
the same way we did with the other one. Just make sure it's blend, blend, blend in. That's what I want to make sure. Maybe if I have to blend it in a lot. I don't know. So let me doing this together. I'm learning just with y'all because I was like, that's kind of cool if I could do that, you know. Maybe if I leave it a little longer. You try that out. Leave it a little longer. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try that. If I leave it a little longer. Okay, now let's put it on this again. And this time, we're going to leave it longer to see if it's that. So I'm going to grab some. And then I'm just going to slap it. Okay. Maybe the way I'm applying it or something, who knows. But like I said, we're doing this together here, right? And I'm just going to put a little bit because this time to see maybe because of the thickness of it. Now let's level it. Let me just take out these little bubbles. The only thing I don't like is a little bubble and it's real like sticky, sticky, sticky. So I will not, maybe it's because the one I'm using, I'm gonna put this this time for four minutes, let's see. Let's clean this surface out and let's try the nail polishes. But this one with the um paints was a fail for me. Let's just say, I'm just saying right now, it was a fail with the purple one. So let's just hope that I need to put more time into it. Okay. Let me clean this out. I like to keep this clean. And I learned this off of YouTube. I was like, oh, cool. Let me just see, right, to see if it works for me. Let me pick out some colors and whatever. But, you know, you always learn from stuff. Maybe if I try with, um, let's see if it's this one. No. Let's try with top coat. This is my um top coat. I'm going to try this one. With, let's see the paint. I'm going to put a little bit of top coat in here. Okay, this is my gel top coat. So let's try with that. Okay, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna try the pink one again. I like the pink one. Oh, I think I put too much of it. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> that was too much. That was too way too much, guys. Let me take. Let me just take out some of that. Yeah, and I'm gonna add more top coat right here. Let me just put it right here better before I mix it together. Okay, that's UV top coat. Okay, this is non, non clean, so I don't have to clean this one. Let's mix this up together. Let's see with the top coat if it's good. So we're doing it both well. Top coat and build up. Yay! Okay, this is the top coat. Mm. Okay, let's try that top coat. 
I have an extra little thing that I don't use, so we can use that. Let me just take this one out real quick and use this top coat. As you can tell, let's see that. So we're using it. Let's see which way is better. Build up gel or top coat? Okay, guys. Oh man, this is so much fun. Imagine I'm building. Okay. Let's go back in. Just did it like anything, right, guys? It's good to have one of these in the side, too, like for your gel. Just when you want to test stuff out. So I have this one in this little bottle right here. Like, always have it in this bottle. Let's see, guys. Meanwhile, that, sh that is getting dry. Let's clean off this surface. No, let's do one more because I just put the other one in there. The um gel one. So I want the gel one to dry. So let's put an extra two minutes. So with the other one, that the colorful ones that we just did, we needed like four minutes on that one, okay? That was the paint. Now we're going to do... Now we're going to do the other one, the nail polish, this one. So we did top coat, I mean, we did the top coat gel. We did the um, build up gel. Now we doing the nail polish gel. But this one is going to be with a build up first. And then if we could do it with a top coat, let's try it with the top coat too. Who knows? Right? And if it's a failure, it's a failure. We're going to learn. This is what we do. Nail people does this. So, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to put a build up and top coat better. How about that? Easier. And I'm only doing one nail polish, okay? And then... On this side, we're going for top coat. Top coat gel. Build up, top coat gel. Build up gel, top coat gel. <laughs> and I'm going to use this blue nail polish. I'm going to shake it. And I'm just going to draw. Just drop. Let it drop. Okay. Now I'm going to drop one over here. Okay. And then I'm going to mix both of them. This one over here. Taco. This is nail polish and top coat gel. This side. Okay. And then this one is the gel. Nail polish. It's like an awkward. Ooh. I'm going to put some more of the blue in here. With the nail polish. I'm gonna put a little bit more over here. <clears throat> okay, this one is done. Let's shake this one on. This one came out kind of darker than this one, right? Kind of cute. Taco Joe. What we're going to do just to brighten that up because I want to brighten it a little bit up. Like give it that brightness on it. I'm going to come with a little bit white 
I don't understand why this is popping up like this. This is getting me upset. I'm just going to bring a little white in here. Right here. A little white gel. Just like a baby blue. See that? Pop that up a little bit. We're about to take those two out right now. Cool. Then let's turn this way. Should we put, I don't have white top coat, so. Light blue, darker blue. Okay, let me clean this up because I don't want it to stay like this. Always oh, an F alcohol. I tell you, this thing is sticky. Oh my God, I'm already 21. Anyway, we learning this together here. I don't care. You don't want to watch it. You can click it and leave it on for later. I'm sorry. I like to do long videos. I'm so used to it because I like to explain myself like, if we're going to do something together, we're going to learn something together. Let's take our time so we can learn it, right? So, I, you know, i seen this on YouTube, I'm going to say, because I didn't, I didn't make this up. Just wanted to see the difference of the nail polish and all that. So, <coughs> this one is nail polish. And this one is the paint. So, now what we're going to do, we're going to take the stacky layer, which you can tell, I won't do paint at all. But... We're gonna clean the tacky layer out. The tacky layer out. Once again, paint failure. Let's see nail polish. Nail polish. Ooh. Nail polish? Better. Paint failure. Nail polish? Amazing. Look at that. So you could do paint. And gel top coats. Cool. Yes, you can. Look at it. It doesn't. But the paint one, this is the paint. As you can tell. See that? That's the paint that I use on with the builder. And this is the top coat with the gel top coat. And look, you can do it. So yes. That's a yes. So you could do paint with top coats, gel top coats. Cool. Yay. Once again, we have this one though. We have the nail polish ones now. Nail polish. This is the builder. And that's the top coat. Let's try these out. Okay. Let's do this one. Remember, you're using a brush that you don't need. I don't need them, you know. Here goes the one with the paint. Sorry. Just playing with it. Okay, so that's the one with the um build up. Now we're doing top coat, which is gonna be over here. I like that blue though. Um, I don't have my white top coat, but if I would have, I wouldn't use it, but I don't. Remember, always have one of these so you can just test your products out. It's kind of nice. It's like a clear. If I had a white under there, I think it would come on. But let's test them because if you're doing one nail polish, it's just a clear. A clear blue. Let's test those out. 
down, la, la, la. let's put them for three minutes. Three minutes. Cool. We have this one. It's a um, build up top gel with the nail polish. These are nail polish now. We did the pair. The paint was a failure with me with the top, with the builder. No work for me. But nail polish, you could do it. I mean, the top coats, you could do it. Top coat and paint, you could do it. It's not a problem, as you can tell. So, we learned this together. I think it was fun. So, let's finish with that, and then I, I will be done here. Then I could just put it up. Mm -hmm. So yeah, while that's getting dry there, like I said, if you have a top coat that you don't use no more gel top coat, just take out whatever is there left and just clean it out. Oh, I forgot to clean my brush up. Clean it out and keep it to the side so when you're doing like top coats, um, different colors or whatever, you always have a little brush so you can test it out and you don't have to use your... I use my play brush. This is my play brush for my gels. I don't use my brushes that I use on a daily basis, but it's good to have one of these. Yes, um, paint and top coat does make sure it dries up fine. But build up, and this one is a no-no. It doesn't come out fine. Um, nail polish, we testing them now, so I use this one. So let's see how the paint, nail polish, and the um, top coat goes. New color tools, I mean colors. I like the blue one. <laughs> okay, on top of my beauty. Uh -huh. On top of my beauty. Thank you. <laughs> Hold on, I'm here, but I'm just waiting on this one to get. Oh my god. Hope everybody's doing fine. Oh my God. This is my last piece of candy. I've been eating these candies since this girl sent me them. I'm like, ooh. It's almost done, girls. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh, no. No. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -hmm. It's almost done. Okay. Remember? This is the um paint um the nail polish top coat. I mean build up. And this is the top coat. So let's go for both of them. Oh my god, please. Mm -hmm. Let me mm -hmm. go. Very clean. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's do this one first. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Mm hmm. Both of them. Mm hmm. Look, guys. Good. Mm-hmm. 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 Don't mm -hmm. mm -hmm. The paint was a freaking failure to me. <clears throat> a certain spot. Like, it was a killer to me. But the paint with the top coat was good. You could do it with the top coats. Joe. And then the um, nail polish ones, they are perfect. Like with the top coat, I mean with the build-up gel, and with top coat. So, that I would do again. Different colors. So, ladies, yes, you could use these two together. And, yes, to both of these, top coat, I mean build-up and top coat. Nail polish, this is to make colors perfect. You could do it as a gel top coat, a build up, 
color. So, this is, I guess, this is good. This is, I would do this. These, I would do again. Because there's no problem you doing them with um, nail polishes. But this with um, build up, no. These two, no. No. Okay? So anyway, ladies, I wanted to show you that because I seen it. It wasn't my idea. It was somebody else's idea. But I know there's a, you know, there's a lot of new ladies here that, you know, will learn off of it like I did. Because we learned together today. Because <laughs> I didn't know what I was getting myself into. So I enjoy doing them. And it's cool that that you could do the um the paint with top coats only gel top coats only i don't know if you could do it with the clear top coats i haven't used it i mean i haven't done it so if you do please share that video um you could do these with nail polishes either build up or top coat so both ways you could do it with this one but with the paint, it only works for me on the top coat. So the top coat gel. And it came out perfect. And, it, and it's not bumpy or nothing. It came out cool. As you can tell. See that? And then the blue one. Nail polish. And this one without. Cool. So ladies, I hope you learned as I did too with you today. And um, if I have another video, I will come up. And with that being said, I've been like 30 minutes. I, I'm just saying. I like doing these. I like to explain myself what we need. So if you like some videos like this, let me know down below. And with that being said, I'm leaving. I'll talk to you what? Later.